Double Trouble 2, Star Guardian Crest, and Second Wind 2. Guys, lock in that Double Trouble. Don't even think about it, man. Don't even think about it, guys. Do we go for a Double Trouble Yumi? Why the frick not? Let's go for a nice little Double Trouble Yumi. Uh, if I win, I can sell everything, right? I make 10. Oh, that's pretty good. And then I'm sure we go for this. And then we go for this. How about this? Oh, yeah. Double Trouble Yumi. Not the best Double Trouble, but we'll see. So apparently you're supposed to run Double double Vein, Double Kaisa, Double Riven. Just a bunch of Double Boys and Girls. Girls. Those are all girls. Excuse me. But yeah, we'll see how it goes. I don't think Double Trouble Yumi is too impressive right now. I'm trying to get something better. Double Trouble Talon would be insane. Uh, who else is good with Double Trouble? Ah, uh, Double Trouble Talon would just be insane, man. That would be the main thing. Nice. We get to sell. We get to make 10 Econ. This is looking good, guys. This is looking like a good game already. Yep, yep. We are goal 3 right now in the new season. Uh, which yesterday, I'm sure it is not the fact anymore because it is 12 hours later. But yesterday... Uh, do I double trouble this? Do I, do I win anyway? Even if I don't level here? I feel like I don't. I feel like I do if I double trouble this though. Yeah, I think that's, that's the right play. Let's double trouble this. That is a banger. I, yesterday, I was ranked 383 on EU West after the stream, which is kind of based, guys, isn't it? That is pretty freaking based. But right now, people probably surpassed me because I, you know, I was sleeping and eating and stuff. What's up, Horizon? What's the best weapon for Aphelios? Duskwave. Duskwave most of the time. If you have no items, Eclipse. Uh, what's up, Feels Bad? First time watching live. Time to see... If you live up to the YouTube videos, oh, I certainly don't. But what's up, uh, Kizame? What's up? And what's up, Rebel? What is up, guys? Are we winning? Ooh, that's a level diff. If I didn't level here, I would have lost 100%. Yeah, guys, the Yumi, we need to fix the Yumi, man. We need a different carry. Maybe we don't need to fix the Yumi. <clears throat> Maybe we don't need to fix the Yumi. I have no money. I have no money, guys. I have no money at all. I really rely on the win streak. If I do not win streak this, I am down horrendous, let me tell you. I am super down horrendous, man. This guy's pretty strong, but I should be chilling. Uh, double Trouble Kale is okay. It's okay. So, with Double Trouble, you basically want to play champions that benefit from both attack damage and ability power. And that want armor and magic resistance as well. So, that's not a lot of them. A double Z is really good. Also, you can't use uh, Threat. It says exactly two copies of non-Threat champions. So, keep that in mind. Uh, it would be too broken with Threats. This would be the best... Belveth would just run out over everybody. If you find six Belveths and they would work with threats, she would just completely kill everybody. Alright, we're still Mr. 100. How's this guy doing? This guy is not that strong, honestly. We're chilling. What am I looking for here? There's a... There's a Yumi with a spatula. But he's taken. What am I looking for? Looking for some cheeky items, no? I'm just gonna go to the, uh, take this. Ah, maybe I should have taken the armor. Ah, maybe I should have taken the armor. Mm. Because I'm not gonna go Archangel, am I? Mm. I'm gonna just do this. I could go Ionic Spark. Oh, I could easily go Ionic Spark. Oh, I'm going Ionic Spark, man. Let's go. <sighs> Double Trouble. Sivir. Two 
Boo, we're going mental. <laughs> Level 6 at 2-5. <laughs> well, that is my earliest. I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry, man. You, you're about to take 50 million damage. I have a good early game item. I have double, double trouble. Nah, fam. I think you're gonna take a fat L. I'm sorry. I am deeply sorry, my guy. Ooh, it's kind of close, though. Look at this. It's kind of close. But I'm pretty sure we're still gonna win. We still have the two double trouble units. Yep. He has a Ginsu's, though. That is very strong. <laughs> that was close. If I did not level here, guys, we would be dead. We would have lost our big win streak. Huh. <sighs> Double Defender or Double Mascot? It's probably Double Defender, no? Uh, it's probably Defender. I think Defender is better than Mascot. But Alistair is better than this guy. Let's see what the enemy is. He's a lot of magic damage, no? I'm just gonna YOLO it, man. I, hopefully we're fine. This guy's Mr. 100, but he has 30 gold. He's not even trying to win streak. He's weaker than the previous guy, I'm pretty sure. But he built a, he built a QSS, man. That's crazy. <laughs> He's so tanky, bro. I have double trouble. Come on. I think we're still winning. Nice. Draven's almost dead. Come on, Yumi. Okay, nice, nice, nice. We got the full win streak. That's big. <laughs> oh, boy. Let's get that. Oh, no. It doesn't work with threats. Remember. Oh, boy, man. That was... That was... That was certainly rough, guys. Let me tell you. So, what are we playing with Double Trouble, man? Mm. Mm, I feel like Double Mascot is cringe. It doesn't do that much. Double Mascot doesn't actually do that much, so... Let's think about selling him. Let's think about... I don't really want to sell the Poppy. Poppy's pretty good. Yo, Deville. 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 Thank you so much for the Twitch Prime. I'm sorry for butchering your name. But thank you, man. Much appreciated. Welcome to Shuriken. Welcome, welcome. Oh, get a Giant Slayer. Not too bad. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Boy. A boy, boy. Boy, boy, boy. A duelist. We need some damage, right? A duelist is worth. We have a giant slayer or a static shiv. Probably a giant slayer, right? It's probably a giant slayer. Who's dealing the most damage in the previous fight? It's kind of close. I think it's going to be Kale now. Because Kale has Duelist now, which she didn't have previous fight. And she did the same amount as the other thing. Uh, we, sell we sell her, actually. Uh, we sell him. We sell him, I think. Alright, guys. This is going to be this is gonna be an interesting game. Holy man. <laughs> this is going to be a very interesting one. I am not sure exactly what I'll do. I'm hoping for a hero augment to make it a simple game. Where I just double trouble the hero augment. And build around it. There's no problem with that, is there? Siphoning wins, Yasuo? Double trouble, Yasuo? Is there any problem with that? Does it go much further than that? With a giant slayer? Does it, does it go much further than that, guys? Don't think it does. I can do this. Oh, this is really good, guys. This is really good. <clears throat> I hope this will work, man. <laughs> uh, we go Hodge. Double Trouble Yasu is great. I hope this will work. The thing is, I'm almost level 7 already. <laughs> After it, after it Yasuo three, after it Yasuo three, but no one's contesting me, right? Unless someone took it afterwards. No, we're chilling. Ah, we're chilling, guys. No one's contesting. Okay, so we need to double trouble this freaking Yasuo. This is really good. 
giving him Omnivamp is so good. Because Double Trouble bounces so well with the uh, Omnivamp because it gives you so much resistances. Healing with resistances gets even better because you have to invest even more damage to get through that amount of health, right? So we need Yasu here. We need Yasu. Double Trouble Yasu would be insane. I probably just roll a little bit, no? Nice, easy. That, that was simple. Do we go double trouble this? I feel like... I feel like it's not worth. I want to go four duelist for sure. I want to go four duelist. Maybe I don't go four duelist. Maybe we just double trouble the scale. If I had double two star kale, I would. But since I have this Yumi two star, I kind of don't want to. He also tanks so much now because he just... Look how strong this enemy is. I still win. This enemy is actually really strong. Let me check him. Does he have 6 laser core? Almost. Almost, guys. Close to 6 laser core. Kinda wanna pick up this vein. Double trouble vein. We, we just wanna double trouble Zed, double trouble Yasu, no? Is that not it? I think that's it. I think that's the dream. Boy. Uh, I wanted the rod. It's gonna be a little bit rough now. Items are looking a little bit rough for me. Right about now. There's nothing good left. He has 90 mana, so blue buff is not that good. Is blue buff good on anybody else? Huh. <laughs> Whoopsie. Whoopsie toopsie. There's no way we level up. We have to roll at 6. We can roll at 7 for Yasuo too. We can maybe roll at 7 for Yasuo too. I'm pretty sure I just play Zed over Yumi. I'm pretty sure Yumi is just garbage here. The blue buff. I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna reforge, man. I'm just gonna wait until Wolves and reforge. We're chilling. We just reforge. YOLO reforge. All the items that were left were useless for me. This guy's really strong. I might lose here, but it's fine. I'm sitting at 59 gold. It's fine to lose the win streak at this point. Yeah, that is fine. That is A-OK. -okay. That is A-OK. -okay. <clears throat> hey, thanks again, Mr. Deweyville. Thank you, man. Hey, man, your videos are so fun. First time on your stream. Keep it up. Welcome to the stream, Mr. VXL. Vayne blue buff, perhaps? Ah, not really interested in playing Vayne. So we need to figure out, are we gonna roll at 7 for Yasu? We need to figure this out. So we need to double trouble Yasu, double trouble Zed. That's already 4 units. And then I have 2 more units, basically. I have room for 2 more units. So I can go Fiora. Fiora Double Trouble is really amazing as well. You know what, man? I think it's just a level 6 reroll. Reroll for Fiora and Yasuo, 3-star. Hopefully get both. Uh, if we get both, we Double Trouble both. That's 4 units. Level 6, Double Z. That's 6 units, plus 1 for tank. Just put a freaking Alistair. Level 7, level 8. Level 8, put Aegis. We're chillin'. We're chillin'. Level 8 put another uh, spe uh, duelist, to be honest. Okay, it's gonna be gonna be an, a complicated game. But I think it's gonna work very well. I think it will work very well, man. No cap. So we... We could roll for level at uh, level 7, man. We could roll at level 7. Yes, it makes the Yasu more rare. Yes. But it makes me... Okay, we roll here a little bit first. For Yasuo's. Oh, Bane. Bane seems very interesting as well. I'm gonna make her. I mean, she's gonna be our other assassin, right? Or, or uh, thingy. 
Okay, so this is gonna be a very complicated game, actually. I, I am not sure how this one's gonna turn out. Four, four uh, thingies now. Okay, another vein. Trying to get one more Yasu, bro. It's a lot of veins, though. Alright, so we definitely go Hodge. We definitely go Hodge on Yasu. We go Giant Slayer on Yasu. We can go Blue Buff on Vein, honestly. Since I got so many veins. Sell Zed? Sell Zed, mayhaps? Nah, no way. No way we sell Zed. Protector's Vow on my single solo tank. <clears throat> Protector's Vow on Fiora. Ooh, it's gonna be a rough game, guys. I'll, I'll keep it a stack. It's gonna be super duper complicated. Oh, Celestial Blessing is so good. Holy, I have six veins. <laughs> okay, I'm pretty sure at this point I just level up. I play like this. And do I just play like this as well? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Do we just kick this puppy? The puppy is not kickable, man. There's no way. I think this is fine. <laughs> I think this is fine. Can we go Giant Slayer. We could go Blue Buff on Vayne, man. I mean, at this point, I'm probably gonna hit Vayne 3 before Yasuo 3, you know? Wait, one guy has Vayne Augment. Where the frick is the Vein Augment guy? I think it's the the, the Death Blade at uh, Thing Augment, right? Into the Night, yeah. He's not going 3 star Vein, right? I don't think he is. He has no Veins. I think we're chilling. I can go Blue Buff on Vein. Ah, Mustard! Musty Mustard! I am not sure. Honestly, this is pretty good. There's no way this is wrong. Frick this, man. Jewel Gauntlet, Yasuo. Honestly, I'll give him the Ionic Spark as well. He's melee range. There's no way I'm just YOLO reforging. Better save the reforger for late game. Ooh, it's gonna be so... What is this set, man? This set is so complicated. This set is so freaking complicated. But honestly, I'm in a really good position. <laughs> I'm in a super good position. Thing is, it's very... Um, Bro, do you have to reroll Yasuo with this? Don't you just accept? Look, man, I just have a good two-star Yasuo. I just have a great two-star Yasuo, bro. That's about it. Don't I just go level 8? I play this guy. And then I, when I get a second Z, I kick the puppies. I put Ox Force. 100%, man. This is a classic example of one of those games where you're like, okay, I wanted to do one thing, but it didn't work. Just go next. You know what I mean? I wanted to do one thing, but life gave you lemons, you know? Gave you vein. So you make the lemonade with vein, man. Right? Oh my god, I would love to drink vein's juice. What? Lemon juice. Lemon juice, guys. Yasuo seems broken with supers. Yeah, but I, I'm, not, I'm not playing supers, right? I'm not gonna be playing supers. Alright, there is no way we're getting that. Maybe maybe we are. No one's playing it. Only the, the first guy is playing it. No. Yes. Oh, that's... That's dirty, man. That is dirty, guys. That is dirty, 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 dirty. Okay, I only spark Yasu. I should be strong enough to win streak anyway. Nah, you know what, man.
I'm not sure if that's weaker. I don't think it's weaker. I'll keep it a buck. I don't think it's weaker. He's full 3-star with Aegis. He's going for the Ash and stuff. Honestly, he might die before he gets everything. But he's pretty strong right now with this stupid Renekton. But no, he's not. Look at this. My Yasuo just face tanks. Giga, Giga Chad Yasuo. Mm, I'm pretty sure this was stronger. Because you enabled the veins. This has to be stronger. There's no way. Four, four duelists is a big up. A step up. It's a big step up. Yeah. Yeah. Our synergies will be four duelists, two ox force. That's about it. There's the ox force Andy, man. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Alright, there's no way I'm not leveling up and playing double trouble Z. There's no way. How much damage does Z deal? 900. But he's so good with double trouble, man. Okay. <clears throat> we good? Guys, I have never been this dizzy. I have no clue what the frick is going on in this set. Double trouble is so complicated, no? In this set. Because you actually have multiple uses. You don't just force Varus. Or Tristana in set 7. You actually play some weird stuff. What is this? <laughs> Guys, I'm a, a little bit insecure, okay? I'll keep it a stack. I checked my rank yesterday on tactics.tools and it said I'm rank 383 on EU West. I'm a little bit insecure. This is uncharted territories for me. I'm a little bit nervous. So I have no clue if I'm playing right. I have no clue if I'm playing right, guys. Keep it a buck 50 with you, man. Keep it a buck arena 50 with you. No cap. Probably not 383 right now, because that, that was yesterday, before sleep. Like, a couple hours ago that I checked it. So do, good, they met threats, unplayable with double trouble. Bro, I'm telling you, again, a lot of people underestimate the AP ratio of Belbat. It's almost as good. AP is almost as good as attack damage on Belbat. So, if you would allow that to be played, it would be the most broken thing ever. Belbat, double Belbat... You could probably double Belveth 2 versus 10 with this double trouble. It'll be that strong. She benefits from every single stat. Edge of Night or what? I mean, with these garbage items, it has to be Edge of Night. Yeah, it has to be Edge of Night. Has to be Edge of Night on Zed. On Zeddington. <laughs> Shall we? Not too bad. What's up, Mazin? What's up, Rugi? What's up, guys? What's up, Arender? Double Belveth, double Zack, and it's GG, yeah. Not even double Zack, man. Probably double Urgot. Holy double Urgot, man. Yeah, you would just play threats. It would be so boring. It's so nice how splashable this fiddle is, man. I'm gonna kick him as soon as I find the second Yasu. Uh, Zed, of course. But that might take some time. I have to play my economy right now. This guy's really strong though. He's not going for three star vein, which is really good. Uh, Ginsu's is so strong. Ah, we're still chilling. Big guys, big. I'm on a huge streak. What about this guy? Eight laser core. He needs he needs Mordekaiser. Uh, is this any good? Is there any way where this is good? Probably not. Am I gonna look for a Zed? Man, I can burn 300 gold here and not find a Zed. Is, is Zed uncontested? Zed is almost uncontested. Let's roll a little bit. Oh, freak. Oh, we're chilling, guys. <laughs> oh, we're chilling. Oh, we're 50, man. We wasted zero gold. This is for sure better. I know Fiddle is super good, but this is better. Z double trouble is insane. I have some janky items though, I have to say. I think the best the, the best uh, thing I did here was ditch Yasuo as a main carry. That was the best, that was the smartest thing I did. 
That was the skill exp expression this game, guys. I recognized I got six veins out of nowhere at level six and only three Yasu, so I dipped instantly and kept playing the vein. And that saved the game so hard. That did so much for the game, guys. I'm not sure if I can win. I'm not sure if this, this board can cap out as a victory. But if I hit three star vein, th uh, two star, another two star Zed, and then maybe three star Fiora, I definitely think we we are we are looking good. I'm just gonna load up my bench with two. Oh frick! No way. By the way, how good is Nila? Nila is really good for double trouble, like super good. But how good is she? Is she better than? Hero Augment Yasuo? No, he just heals back to full. Bring CC with him as well. He just heals back to full, man. That is just too good. Ah, guys, I'm proud. I'm proud. I played well. I played well, guys. First game of the day. First game of the day, man. We're doing well already. Yesterday, the first two games were cringe. They were. I played so badly. Oxforce. Oxforce Z is insane. Uh, we don't need BT, I think. What do we need here? Another Hodge? I mean, Oxforce is insane, no? Don't I just go for Oxforce? But how do we fit for Oxforce, guys? We don't need four Oxforce. I mean, for Oxforce level 9. Oh, frick! This might be a level 9 game. Oh, it might be a level 9. Oh, I think I'm going level 9. For sure. Oh, I think I'm going level 9. Uh, who gets the Oxforce? Has to be has to be Zed, no? Who, who's the b b best carry, man? It's Zed, bro. It's Zed. He's doing so much damage. He's so strong, man. Oxforce, four Oxforce, huge attack speed buff. Yeah, we're chilling. Huge attack speed buff, guys. That is ridiculous. My Zed has like 15 lives. He will never die. He doesn't have a lot of life steal, but he he does have a little bit from the Celestial Blessing. And double trouble. This is such a good comp. This guy got like we got close to getting beaten by this guy last time. Now we just omega lulled all over him, man. Oh my god, guys. We just all over him, boys. Oh my god. Uh, honestly, I think it's a level up, man. If I keep win streak here, it's crazy. Alright, let's go. What a goofy uh, comp. Is this not the dumbest comp ever? Do you hit the gym, boy? I do calisthenics. If you have duelist combo, Ginsu's is kind of griefing, right? It depends, it depends. If you go 8 duelist, it definitely is griefing, yeah. But if you're not, then yeah. Z3 incoming? Definitely not anymore. I decided to level instead of going for Z3, right? But as soon as I get the Oxforce spatula, it's too good. He hits the thing. Oh, wait. He just... He has uh, nine... No, he doesn't have laser core. He's still looking for uh, Mordekaiser. But he's trying to level up. And if he hits Mordekaiser, he's chilling. I can't hit Z3 because this guy has... Um... This guy's gonna win. This guy's gonna win. Because there's no way he doesn't hit level 9. There's no way he doesn't hit level 9. And then he hits Mordekaiser, he's 9 laser core. Which is very, very powerful. But I'm very happy with the second place, guys. Because this looked... The way I was getting dizzy. The way I was not hitting Yasuo's. This looked like a disgusting... A bottom... A bottom 2, man. 6th, 7th. That's what it looked like. No cap. Hell yeah, brother. Swole AF. Hey, thank you, man. Not really, though. Yeah. I roller with Super Spurs Mascot is so good. I use the Malphite and 3-star bunch of them. Nice, nice. Still a little bit risky, no? Okay, let's see what the last item is. It's gonna be either on Yasuo or on Vayne. Honestly, if I hit 3-star Vayne, maybe we can still win. But I, I gave up on that option, right? I decided to go for the safe route. I decided to go for a very safe route. I mean, Zeke's is completely insane. Goes on the second Yasuo for sure. Uh, Z, excuse me. Okay. Now we just roll for Yasuo too. 
Z2, excuse me. I keep saying Yasuo for some reason. Okay, so I have to think here. I don't think we're actually playing Diego. I think we're looking for Aphelios because Aphelios is gonna have more utility. Viego, naked Viego does nothing. Naked Aphelios, you give him Eclipse and he goes crazy. This guy is really strong. I hope I can kill him here. He has a Renegade emblem, which means he can go six Renegade. And that is a very dangerous thing. So it's good we take him out here. Nice, nice. Mr. Laser Core, you gonna kill this guy? Yes, sir. Oh, you didn't. Oh, that is not good. Actually, it might be good, because I might get first. Okay, nice. Oh, there we go. There's the Mr. Binding Eclipse. Let me hit that Z2, man. Come on, baby. Oh, I'm, I should actually hold these guys. <laughs> get the ratted boy. <laughs> Little rat boy. <laughs> boy. <laughs> I'm going full rat. Maybe I should have stopped double troubling the Fiora. The Fiora isn't... I mean, she's one of my tanks, right? She's not doing badly. But maybe doubling, double troubling the Fiora is a mistake. What are what are you guys thinking? Because then I could have hit uh, level 8 full Ox Force, right? I'm still double troubling a lot of units. Oh my god, we're beating them. We're beating, we're doing it, sir. We lose against this guy. We have a little bit of a rock, paper, scissor action going on. I'm, I'm ratting for sure with this Mordekaiser. No cap. No way I'm not ratting this. Oh, there's the Z though. Now I have to decide. Uh, I probably actually sell this. I probably sell this. No cap. Yeah. Oh, guys, the little rap boy. Do you see my teeth? Give me those. Give me those. Uh, give me that cheese, boy. Oh, give me that cheese. I'll rat you all day, boy. Frick. It's fine. Hold the Mordekaisers. He's gonna turn into an absolute disaster. Honestly, he's, him killing my vein is big for him. Uh, I mispositioned. He predicted it. If we win this, it's GG though. Why am I stunned for like 15 minutes, bro? Uh, that is so sad. If I won this, it's GG. Ugh, mispositioned Vayne. No Zeeks either. Oh, really? You're not gonna take Zeeks away from me? Oh, I don't know about this one, boy. I don't know what... I, I don't know about this one. Uh, what's up, Sloth? <sighs> Alright, now we're against this guy. He has two-star Mordekaiser as well. Okay, honestly, um... Just do this. Alright, let's do this. I think we're good. He's completely on the wrong side. Oh, he's positioning around the other guy, of course. Okay. I hope we're good. I think we're good against this guy. His Fiora... Uh, his Leona is really strong. Oh, wow. This guy is really strong, bro. Oh, but now I'm winning. Nice. Oh, wait. He's gonna kill the... Kill the, the this guy. Holy, that's good. Oh, what a close ending of the game, man. What a close ending of the game. Oh, another vein, bro. Another vein. Hmm. That is interesting. Am I selling this guy to roll? Probably not. If I hit another two star Yasuo, it's a better double trouble than the Fura. Let's just chill. Let's just chill. We still have health left. Still have health left, guys. Maybe I should have gone Hacker, right? A little bit. Hacker could have been worth. What do you think, guys? <laughs> Maybe Hacker was worth because I could send him into the backline. 
Yeah, maybe we go hacker instead of double trouble on the Fiora. Oh, I like that. It's so much lifesteal for my two Zeds. I feel like that's the play. I think that's the play, bro. Yeah, we go hacker. Do we have a prankster? We don't. So we can just go LeBlanc. We don't need Zoe. Ooh, we lose against this guy. Okay. I'll, I'll find another hacker. I'm not... I'm not... <laughs> okay. Double trouble vein might also be a ditch. No cap. Because then we would get prankster and Aegis. Maybe that's worth. There's a lot of magic damage on both comps. Okay, I can sell the Mordekaiser. He hit Mordekaiser. This guy has nine laser core now. I think I might get third. I might get third unless I hit uh, Vayne. What a crazy close game, though. Let's see if we can hit Vayne. I need one more Vayne. Let's pick up a hacker as well. I missed one already. Oh, that was a little bit silly. I might miss hacker now. Oh, frick. Oh, freak! Oh, Edge of Night? Oh, freak! What a crazy ending! Nah, this guy's nine laser core, guys. It's just so much damage. Don't think we can beat him, but maybe we can beat this guy's ghost. Wait, he's playing against the 9 laser core guy. Surely the 9 laser core guy beats him. Wait, he doesn't? Oh, that is not good. Oh, that is not good, guys. I mean, I hit... I hit... I, I'm, I'm strong, though. Come on, guys. I'm strong, right? There's actually no way we play... We don't play Double Trouble Vein now, right? Oh, Ephelios. I don't have money. I'm probably dead, no? I'm just gonna keep the positioning. I feel like I can beat this guy. It's just the ghost. Please, the ghost. We can beat him. Oh, please. Please. What a close game. What is this? I'm too dizzy for this, guys. I'm way too dizzy for this. Wait, this guy's way too strong. Nah, it's just the legendaries, bro. You just build a bi billion legendaries, you're chilling. Wait, wait. I think we're fine, Oxforce. Bro, kill this stupid girl. Nice, nice. Yes! Okay, now it's just the laser core guy. The laser core guy is stupidly strong, though, man. Like, stupidly, stupidly strong. Who's the main carry? It's just the Yasuo, isn't it? Or the Zed, I mean. This guy is way too strong. He still doesn't have 2-star Mordekaiser, by the way. Maybe Aegis was the play, but... Whoa, nah, man. For sure, double trouble. <sighs> he probably switched. Yeah, he, he's, he, he just has to move one unit. I have to move 15 units, you know. But I have... Uh, I have... Uh, like, Edge of Knights. So I'm chilling. Doesn't really matter. Nice, she's not getting stunned. But it, it, it's just six uh, laser core, man. It's supposed to be, like it's a chase trade. You need two emblems. You can't. You can, literally can't. Uh, you literally can't. You you can't beat it. You can beat it, but not not with the comp I had, right? Maybe Aegis. I could have ditched double trouble vein for prankster Aegis. Maybe that would have made a difference. Uh, because it is a lot of magic damage, but it is also... It's like split damage, right? Because he still has uh, the Zed doing most of the damage, right? It's not like it's only magic damage. It's still... Like, look, it's a full physical Zed, you know? Um, the Mordekaiser was just cosmetic there. Didn't do anything. He was one star. It's just about this thing just tanking and stunning everybody. And then this guy just finishing them off. The drones definitely did a lot of damage, don't get me wrong. 
but uh, losing double trouble on Vayne is also pretty big, and it's a three-star full item Vayne. Anyway, guys, I think I played it very well. Very good performance, cool comp as well. Subscribe, ring notification bell if you enjoy these TFT videos. Also, make sure to leave an algorithmic comment and an algorithmic like down below to support this video in the YouTube algorithm so I can get some more views, and I'll see you next time. Peace.